Hey YouTube, how's it going? Smoking some plum cake today. I put this tin away about a year ago and uh, I wasn't sure if I liked it or not. I don't know what it was, but uh, found it again and decided to try it out. I'm trying to get away from aromatics, so this is going in the right direction, I know that. Apparently this little indicator shows that it is kind of sweet, I guess. And to me, I don't pick up any sweetness. I want to talk a little bit about uh, packing methods. Um, I'm coming up on a year now of pipe smoking and I've always stuck to the same, uh, the three layer method. Basically, it's easiest to pick up at first. So last week I figured, uh, you know, why not see if I can pick up some new methods. And I uh, did some research, found a YouTube video, it's called the, uh, the Frank Method. Basically what it is, is you, you uh, basically gravity fill your pipe, just kind of drop the tobacco in loosely or just fill it up you know, dip it in, fill it up, and then you take a pinch, you lay it on top, and then you kind of work it around. You don't actually press the tobacco in, you just work it in from the sides, kind of like if you could visualize putting a cork in a wine bottle and kind of just pressing it in from the sides. Hmm. Can't get this to say lit. And I like that method a lot. I find I pick up more flavor in my tobacco. It takes longer to, to pack your bowl. It's messier than the three layer for sure. It's all drops tobacco all over the place. So you gotta have something down to pick them up. But I liked it better. It was a cooler smoke. Um, I didn't have to relight it, I found. This I haven't tried, I'm relighting it all the time. I just quickly packed it today but it stayed lit longer and I didn't have to tamp it down until it was at least halfway. And the video, I'll put a link in my video here and it will explain to you the, how to do it properly. I guess it's also called a German method. I guess it's a, an old German guy is doing it in the video. The veterans on here probably, you guys know what I'm talking about, but the newer ones probably don't. And then there's a, a hybrid method where it's basically you skip the filling it up loosely at first and then you just use that, you know, use that uh, packing method where you, from the sides and then it creates a well at the bottom. It's called, it's like an air pocket. So uh, for moisture and stuff to collect down there, it, it doesn't leave any dawdle behind and I guess it's good too, but I haven't really tried that one too much. But well, yeah, if you're looking for a new way to pack your pipe, definitely try one of those out. If you just type in hybrid method on Google, it probably will come up. But I'll put a link for that other video. There was none for the hybrid method, no video on YouTube. We are uh, cloning cats here now. Um, this one, these are the kittens that uh, my wife's cat had. She had four of them. And this one is probably for sale. We'll start the bidding at $5. <laughs> this is something I want to show you guys that's pretty funny. If you're rooting for the Netherlands in the World Cup, you'll find this pretty humorous. 
Pipe Friends CHS. You might want to use this as your background on your computer. Kind of like a spoof from the movie 300. Or this is Sparta. What a dirty kick that was. That guy should have got a red card for sure. Alright guys. Well, enjoy the rest of your week. And we'll talk to you soon. Take care.